Hey guys, in today's video, I'm just going to show you a tool um, called ShareSite that I use to help me out um, come tax time to work out uh, my two ETFs that are domiciled in the United States and how I use this system to deal with um, currency conversion and stuff like that. So first of all, uh, here's the website and you can go here and you can make an account for free. Um, as long as you've got under 10 holdings, you can use it for free. Anything above 10 holdings, I think you have to pay like 10 bucks a month or something like that. Um, so this is what ShareSite looks like. It's really good. I use it for all my um, reporting on how well my portfolio is doing. Um, gives you some nice graphs here that work out how much you've made through capital gains and dividends or how much you've lost um, uh, during uh, over periods of time and gives you a nice little summary here of like the total that I've made and how much of that was through capital gains and how much of that was through income. Um, and then there, here's the three ETFs that um, we invest in and just breaks it down um, really nicely. So for the purpose of this video, what you want to do is you want to go to the reports um, section here and you want to click on taxable income report, which will bring you to this page. So when you, you get to this page, um, there's some really cool stuff here. Uh, first of all, if the ETF is um, an Australian ETF, like one of mine is, which is VAS, you get to see some cool stuff. Um, how much of the income was franked, how much was unfranked, um, tax deferred, you know, all this stuff that's uh, really handy um, when filling out a tax return. But what I use it mainly for is this foreign income section here. Because I got the two ETFs, VEU and VTS, that are domiciled in the United States, um, you got to work out the exchange rate for the dividend that was paid during that time and convert it to Australian dollars um, to put it into your tax return. Um, now you can do that without this system, but this system just, it makes it uh, super easy because it works out when the dividend was paid, what the exchange rate was and all that stuff and just, yeah, it gives you a net amount here, um, foreign tax with, withholding, uh, withheld and the gross amount. Can't be any easier than that. Um, and if you don't, if, if you are doing it yourself, you could just plug these numbers um, into where they need to go. I'll probably do a separate video about that because I do plan to do uh, tax returns in the future myself. My last tax return, I actually went through an accountant because I had some other complicated stuff I had to deal with. So what I ended up doing was just clicking on this button up here, which is convert this to a PDF. And it spits out something like this. Um, so I simply just forwarded this onto my accountant and he plugged it in where it needed to go. Um, and it was as simple as that. And that's about it. Thanks.